Hey guys, Zach Gardner here with Vapor Owning Technologies. I wanted to walk you guys through the brand new fully automated hands-off Vapor Honing VHT 1500 fully automated Gladiator. So the first thing we're going to do is open the door. That way you guys can kind of get a picture of what's going on inside. With this machine, we have four guns, all of which hit maximum flow, CFM, PSI, and they all put out really good slurry rates. Also, we have an automated rinse system, so after the cycle is finished, the part gets automatically rinsed for 45 seconds. Also, a window rinse, just in case you guys kind of want to see the after effects of your part. So, let's walk around here to the side and check out the, uh, the brand new basins. So this brand new basin, it's a bigger capacity basin. So it also runs off of a diaphragm pump. That way we can control that automated rinse cycle. And here is all of your pneumatic components. It's all separate from your electrical. It's, it's not out here to where it can get hit by a forklift or possibly dinged up in any type of way. It's all protected right in here. And with that, you guys can control your precision regulator right here. You can control what flow rate you guys want. Whether it be 40 PSI, 80 PSI, 120 PSI, this guy will handle it. On this side of the machine, this is your operator station. So as you can see, we have a digital potentiometer to control the turntable speed. So that is all going to depict on basically how long you want the part to run. If you want the part to run longer, do a slower speed. If you want it to run faster, do a higher speed for the turntable. With that, we have an HMI system. If I close the door, you'll be able to see all the functionality of this. So, if we go to operation op options, we have three different travel motions. So we can do step travel, that means just inching up a little bit at a time. We can also do continuous travel, which just continues up and down for a predetermined time that you input. You input the part height, you input the time, and that's how it'll run. And then multi-step travel. This travel gives you an up step. Typically, you would want to do an up step of more than your down step. So say like a two inch up step, and then a down step of one inch. So it'll go up two inches and then down one inch. That way you get maximum coverage when you're doing step travel. Also, we have advanced safety features in this machine. We have an e-stop button. And also, when you open the door, you have an indicator that comes up on the screen that says, hey, the door's open. The machine will not run unless you close the door. If I go to hit start, it's gonna think for a minute and it's not gonna do anything. So when we close that door and then hit the start button, everything works just fine. Hit that e-stop, boom, it's done. Reset it, it travels back to home. So if you guys have any questions about this machine, please contact the sales team. Check us out on Instagram at Vapor Owning Technologies and we thank you for watching this video.